Hi everybody, Carolyn Freyer Jones here to talk about the 2020 CFJ Coaching Success School. That's right, round two, we're coming back. And people still ask me, like, well, why? Why are you doing this? And what's the school about? And that's a great question. It's an important question because this school was birthed out of an idea. It was birthed out of love. And when I first started coaching, with my best friend and business partner, Michelle Bauman, who some of you know about, some of you don't. She passed away about three years ago. We had all the same questions that every coach has, which is, can you really do this and make a decent living? How does that work? How do I do it in a way that I don't feel slimy and yucky? And we had all those same questions. And we turned to our coach, Many of you know the godfather of coaching, Steve Chandler, who's on faculty at the CFJ Coaching Success School, and he, he helped us learn how to do this. And we both started working with coaches ourselves. So I've been working with coaches probably for over 12 years now, helping them learn how to grow a thriving, financially successful business that keeps them at the heart of it in the sense that you don't have to betray yourself. You don't have to become someone you don't want to be. All the faculty who teach at my school, Amber Chris. Devin Bandison, Stephen McGee, all of these coaches are uniquely themselves. And Michelle would always say to coaches, you're a market of one. Nobody has what you have. And that's true. So often, especially now, coaches are being fed all these things on Facebook about you can grow your business in 10 easy steps, do it online, do it with video, do it quickly. That's not how the CFJ Coaching Success School rolls. So we have a six month program where we all come together for two and a half days a month and we're together and we learn how to have slowed down, meaningful conversation that assists someone in seeing that you can help them transform their lives. Because that's all anybody wants. They want to know if you can help them. And you don't need to be fancy. You don't need to make videos and blogs unless you want to do that. So this school is learning how to do that over and over and over again. And it's also keeping in mind not only our own humanity, but everybody's humanity. That's important. I just talked about this in another audio that often coaches, when we want money and we need money in our lives, we look at people like those cartoon characters, right? Like they're a body with a big dollar sign on their head. That doesn't feel good, not just for you, but for the person you're looking at. And in this school, we learn how to drop any attachment to our own concerns, our own money needs, and be with someone and just serve them and learn how to do that over and over and over again. This is a business where you learn how to do this through being coached, through being taught this by someone who's walked the path. I can tell you that I've walked the path, Amber has, Steve Chandler has, Stephen McGee and Devin, and it's the most fun thing. This is where I put my heart and energy into working with coaches now, uh, and I love it. It's so fun, and we welcome coaches from everywhere. So we had coaches in the first school coming from Hawaii, from New York, from uh, D.C. We had coaches this year we're talking to who are talking about coming from London. So we have coaches who come from all over, and whether or not you ever come, the most important thing that you know is you can learn how to do this. You can learn it by hiring a coach who knows how to do this through heartfelt service. You can. There's so much possibility possibility in this profession. I'm not a coach who's like, oh God, too many of us are coming. There is somebody for everybody. There's over something like 8 billion people on the planet. And there's a coach that you can serve someone and you can be yourself, whether you're quiet, whether you're extroverted, it doesn't matter. You can learn how to serve someone and grow your business. So I hope this is helpful, even if you never come to the school, that you hear the possibility. I'm a fan of this profession and I'm rooting for you. Have a great day.